Hey guys, Mine Shaft plays here, and today we are going to be playing Minecraft Population. Sorry for all those loud noises in the background, but not just any Minecraft Pocket Edition, as you can probably tell. This menu is a little different. Since when were there achievements? We'll get to all of that in this awesome video showcasing Minecraft 0.15.0. Alpha build 1, and I'm pretty sure alpha build 2 is out, but I'm too lazy to go download it, so, <laughs> anyway, let's, um, down, let's, let's play, so, I'll show you how it works, so, options, you can see, I'll show you all the options that are different, so, I can change my date, my gamer tag, by the way, my gamer tag is Mineshaft Plays, for anyone who has this and wants to play, I can go to my Xbox settings, and I'm not gonna show you guys, um, I can broadcast, so you can have a multiplayer game like normal, right? Which you can turn on and off. Broadcast to LAN, which has always been there, that you can play with people nearby. But now they have broadcast to Xbox Live, which lets you um, not just play with people near you, but play people on that you have um, friended on Xbox Live. Next, we have uh, controls, which are pretty much the same thing, and. And we have this, uh, the, like, graphics, which are the same thing. So there, are, that's the only difference in the settings. Achievements. Now we have, um, achievements. All these achievements. I'm not sure if it shows you all the ones you have. Yeah, it's, um, I just upgrade. I just updated, so it's not showing me all the stuff I, um, it's not showing me the stuff I did do yet, because achievements were just added, but. Now the skin selector is a little different. I'm going to scroll up. So now your default skins are here. Your um, the the skin you uploaded is here. So you can also choose a new skin. You can pick that. You can pick from your skin packs, but you can see the UI is a little different. And then there's the languages, and then this thing right here next to the languages um brings you to your Xbox settings. So let's go into the game and you already see things are different. So I have my regular world, I got you know, I got my I got this world I was messing around in uh for the update. My uh survival series. So my or in other words, my survivor survival serial <laughs> but um psh. TNT cannon, which is, well, I'm not going to go into my detailed worlds, but then you have your survival, uh, your servers here that you can add. You can see you can also add a friend, which I'm not going to do. And then you can still add a server like normal. And the UI for that is still the same as the old UI, which I'm guessing they're going to change soon. Oh, I got something on my screen that I got to scratch off. What the heck was that? But let's get into gameplay. So this is the uh, the world I've been messing around in, in the update, as you can already see, they have pistons! Yes, they have pistons. Not to mention, they have a brand new block called the Observer Block, and I set up a giant system here that doesn't really demonstrate exactly how it works, but I can demonstrate right now. So let me get myself an, an, ob an Observer Block, and then we'll take some sort of thing that's activated by redstone, and we'll put, um, we'll put a block on it. And then an observer pointing at it, and whenever the observer is given a block update, oh wait, no, you gotta do it the other way. You gotta point it at the block the observer is observing. So as you can see, every time it is given a block update, it gives out a redstone pulse. Um, every single time. And this is a new block, this is not in PC yet. It is, um, it is a temporary Pocket Edition exclusive, at least for now. But that is uh, one feature. Now, if you go over here, you can see we find we have the tipped arrows now. So if I were to go get myself a bow, uh, let's see. Oh, the bow is up here, and then let's get ourselves say an arrow of poison, and then shoot a horse friend. Um, oh yeah, by the way, I forgot to say, horses are now added as well, that is the next part. Oh, what? No, 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 that's not what I want. That is not what I want, I want to shoot you. So if I shoot you with an arrow, you can see it continues to take damage because it, it was a poison arrow. And for some reason, B is making me crouch. What does... Okay, I guess B doesn't throw items then? I'm gonna have to remap my controls right now on the fly. <laughs> Uh, drop item B. 
Okay, that is button one. Save. Save with unassigned actions. What's unassigned actions? What? What's the unassigned one? Sneak, fly down. What? No, pause. I want to be this. And unassigned. That'll be boom. Save. What? Unassigned? Fly down slow. Boom. Save. Finally. Now it won't let me leave. Unassigned. Move right. Oh, wait. No, no, no. Alright, let's just cancel, whatever. But now I can't throw items. Okay, now, okay, I fixed it. Alright, I fixed it. Cool, cool. So. Oh, uh, what was I, what was I doing? Okay, yeah, now if you look at the new spawn eggs, you can see there's spawn eggs for things that don't even appear. There's spawn eggs for mobs that don't have spawn eggs in PC, for instance. Skeleton horses. Um... Zambi horses, wither skeletons. I don't know the, the all of them, but of course now we have horses. Uh, we have donkeys and mules, which are in the console version. They have um eggs in the console version, but they they're just um they're just the texture is just um a horse egg. But these have different textures now. If I'm gonna have to turn my no 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 not invite players. Uh, turn the difficulty up so I can spawn a wither skeleton and now you can spawn them in your overworld whenever you want you also have the zombie horse and the the, uh, the skeleton horse I just showed you these can both I'm pretty sure be I don't can they be tamed like um, regular horses Ugh, why do I keep getting the babies I guess not what about the okay cool you got the you got the danky is it the danky or the mule I think the mule I don't think can you ride mules? Okay, yeah, you can you can ride everything. I used to think it was donkeys you couldn't ride, but you could put chests on. But I guess I was wrong. So also what they have that is um coming to 1.10 in Minecraft PC is the husk mob, which is the one that when it attacks you gives you hunger. Um and then what I was looking for, I don't know if they have it. Let's see, build your chicken, cow, pig, yeah, all that stuff. Uh, was the stray. I wanted to know if they had the stray on here as well. But I'm not 100% sure if they have the stray with their skeleton. Oh, yeah, here's the stray. So, I guess... Oh, wait, but they burn. They burn in the day. All right, let's spawn one in the water. But, yeah, as you can see, they're white-eyed skeletons. And they're super fast, as you probably saw a second ago. They walk faster. And when they shoot, they shoot you with, um, slowness arrows... And when you kill them, they'll normally just drop regular arrows or bones, like regular skeletons, but they have an uh, occasional chance to drop slowness arrows. So as far as I know, those are all the new features in Minecraft Pocket Edition 0.15.0. But, um, they might add some soon. Well, that's about it for this episode. I'll see all you... Uh, lovely people later <laughs>